Okay, this is the Nexus 4. And running Ubuntu. As you can tell, it takes a while to power up for you. Don't mind the poor quality on the video. I'm currently using my old HTC trophy. Not famous for a good camera. Okay. So there she be. So you can see my reflection in it. Okay. So. the home page is the way of putting it. I'm just going to the actual home down on the bottom. Here are your apps. So camera. Camera is one of the few things that actually does work. So cool. Not too bad I can to use my camera to film this. If you go from the bottom, look for the little markup, and it brings up, well, what's the word for it? Magnifying glass. Hit the X, and it'll actually close up the app. Phone's working, gallery's working, it has the stock photos, though, that would come with the um, OEMs, I guess would be a way to put it, uh, system. Facebook just uses the browser, same with Gmail. So all of these are just basically bookmarks on the browser. Amazon, I have not tried. I don't care. Calculator, just like music, calculator, they are both screenshots. So, nothing happening there. Why don't I show? Here, let's get that back down. So, you want to get rid of an app? Come on, there we go. So now if I want, let me go ahead and open up. You know what's funny? Ubuntu One works. Go figure. The app where they want you to spend money works. <laughs> so yeah, if you go from there, it brings up your other apps. Well, that's pretty cool. And of course, you go from the bottom, you have your apps that are open, settings as well. You hit the X. Come on, man. There we go. Closes out the app. That magnifying glass. Boom. Now, you can see from up here, you can go into your messages. These, of course, are just the stock messages that come with the phone. So, Facebook, text message, call. You can also do clear all, and it gets rid of them. Then there is sound. Over. We got battery and brightness, network, and date and time, which I still can't figure out how the hell you set it. But okay, apparently it is 6:25 a.m. in London. Cool. Ah, uh, let me show you for people that do want to test it out. It took me forever to figure it out, but I found out how you delete contacts. So. If you want to delete a contact, you have to go to contacts. Then you go to the contact name, so. Go ahead and block up his phone number because I'm a nice guy. Then you go to edit. You're going to have to drag the keyboard down. You can bring it back up. And there's delete. And it's gone. Yeah, seems like quite a few steps. And you have about 25 different contacts that come on there on stock that you will have to get rid of. And that, my friends, is the Nexus 4 running Ubuntu phone. Daily driver, I don't recommend it. Hint, hint, I'm using a Windows phone to film this. Uh, if you want to develop apps, have some fun with it. Again, this is the alpha stage, so if that
that's what you're looking for, do it to it and help make this thing cool. Anything's better than Apple. Take it easy.